Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Ultimate General... Wrong game. Ultimate Admiral Age of Sail. So, we're gonna start a new campaign. And the uh, reason for that is uh, the last campaign uh, at the Snatch mission you might have gotten there, you might not have in your own campaign. I kind of hit a wall, I can't get past it. I have tried multiple times. And I think part of that is due to me losing those sloops of war to capsizing. So, it's differently. <clears throat> Excuse me, of course I take your uh, comments into mind, so be sure to comment. I'm going to change how I do with the campaign. And we're going to do it better. So we're going to rule the waves again. And this time for real. For generations, my family has sailed the seas. Since before my grandfather's time, it has been our destiny. And now, it is mine. One day I went sailing and found that my old boat had sprung a small leak. Um, let's see. Repair cost reduced, cheaper upgrades. Um, let's do success chance. And went to sea anyway. I would fix the hole later. At twelve, my uncle made me an apprentice aboard his ship. Standing between land and sea, I felt like a man for the first time. Anticipating a life on the open sea, I dreamed of battle and glory on the horizons. But life is difficult in the Royal Navy. Far removed from dreams of glory. Remembering my father's lessons, I worked hard to impress the crew. In time, I was made a midshipman, beginning new responsibilities. Um, let's see, crew training, casualties. I drilled the crew training. And made We're not sure doing the same as last time. Gunners in the fleet. We were forged together in the crucible of battle. For gallantry, I was recommended for promotion to the rank of lieutenant. But first, I must pass the lieutenant's exam. I was summoned before a board of captains. After a lengthy examination, they asked me what I thought the Navy's greatest strength was. Um. Yeah, reputation. Reputation, I responded. Other nations fear us, and we can use this to our advantage. They nodded their heads in assent. Then asked me for my appraisal of the Navy's current strategic situation. We're again going to do normal difficulty. I mean, I failed. Uh, I failed our normal difficulty, so. Admirable, but our enemies are always looking for an advantage to use against us. An old, grey-haired captain asked me about my skill in the organization That's this of guy. amphibious operations. It has to be. Only one with grey hair. Uh, normal, yeah. I've read many books about tactics and strategy, and I am confident in my ability to command. The board applauded my answers and took a moment to reach their consensus. Congratulations, sir, they said. You have just made lieutenant. Awesome. Um, we're going to do... Nah, we're going to do Nelson. I'm sorry, I have to do Nelson because, hey, it's Nelson. I mean, it's Nelson. Do I have to say more? And this time, I'm going to not mess up. I said it last time. Okay. Spain guards the mouth of the San Juan River with a strategically placed fortification under the command of the Captain General of Guatemala. Securing the entrance to the river opens the route to Lake Nicaragua and will bring all these rich, rich lands under the authority of Britain and His Majesty King George III. A frontal attack seems suicidal, but it seems we have no other options available. You will have to secure the fishing village and then march uphill. Seize the fort and disable its coastal batteries. The Spanish will do their best to cancel your plans, so you need to act swiftly and fast. Be aware of the enemy coastal guns. They can obliterate your assault troops. Spotted. Spain has a naval patrol in the area. Our ship has been intercepted by the corvettes Galga and Mercedes. Their opening volleys raked the bridge, 
the captain is badly wounded and the first lieutenant is missing. The situation is grim. Our troop ships follow behind. They will avoid the naval battle and wait for its resolution. Without our protection, they will become easy prizes for the Spaniards. HMS Ceres, a light-armed brig, has sailed up to join us in the fight. The crew is desperate for a leader who can bring the ships through its trial by fire. You have no choice but to take the command. So, we are on board HMS Richmond. I have a, I have a cunning plan. Load the grape. Full sail ahead. Let's capture these buggers. We're just going to go straight for the boarding if we can. That's one of the advice one of you gave me. Just go straight at him. And I mean, it makes sense. We have a significant more amount of crew. Like, we have more... 280 versus their 260 in total. It's a no-brainer. That's a lot of heal. And I'm going to take one of them as a prize as well as my plant. The other I'll send to the Admiralty for the, the reputation point. And my reasoning for that is, well, they're nice ships. Well, they're not that nice. I mean, I barely got to use them last time, anyways. So, uh, it's not like I'll lose anything. Distance is good. Slow down. Speed is good. Angle is not. Come on, Gaga, allow us to go for the boarding. The Ceres won't, won't go for the boarding simply because she is massively outcrewed. Let's go for the Mercedes instead. Sod the Gaga. the Mercedes. There we go. Let's don't fire the port cannons. We don't want to shoot the Mercedes while uh, the Richmond is boarding. Easy victory. Easy victory. Okay, let's have heard the series drop anchor. We will send one of these guys over there to uh, uh, um, what you call it. Um, we'll send a price crew. That's what I wanted. Over to the Mercedes ASAP. But first we need to take care of the Galga. And to do that, the, the Richmond needs to turn around. Like spike. I don't know what it is, but I've been facing a few more like spice spikes in this game the last few days. So one of the patches must have done something, uh, something to ruin my FPS. Come 
Come on, we can take the shots. Come on. There we go. Drop anchor. Come on. Bollocks. Let's speed things up a little. Uh, let's drop the anchor. Yeah, drop anchor. Nope. Turn to port, but don't go full speed. Just enough to turn. Feel, to, feel free to fire at the Gaga. The least damage of the Mercedes and the Gaga is what will become our uh, prize ships. Come on. You're close. You were close. Let's see, we'll sell you over there. Boarding has begun, excellent. This should be easy victory for the Richmond. And indeed it was. Uh, we'll send one of you over there. Let's see, Richmond. Get the other one. Sail full spread it, sail ahead. I want a nice price crew for the Mercedes. And then I can make the claim that I have ha uh, I have a Mercedes. I don't have a Mercedes car, car but I do have a Mercedes. Let's sell you there. Let's sell you there. And Let's wait a little for sandwich. Go for the tag. Uh, I think the Mercedes is the one. Oh, sell quick double speed to the Mercedes. It'll take a little while still, but... We don't want to lose the Mercedes regardless. I 
Excellent. Now they can start working on the flooding. Come on, Nelson. Keep on going to the Mercedes. There you go there. And you go there, sure. Full sail. There's the battery. Already going better than the previous playthrough. Let's have these guys already start their landing. Excellent. Excellent. If I'm not wrong, there's some cannons there, if I remember right. Oh, I remembered right. Okay, you go ahead and start attacking here. You start working towards the cannon. of you. Let's see. You too. Roll swiftly and charge the cannon. Didn't I tell you to charge? Get him, boys! Everyone except you, attack. Come on, destroy this bad these guys. Excellent, let's pop them on board the boat. You are going to take the cannon. You're going to attack the team. Uh, tiradores you are going to march there green you can stay in here come on get a battery garrison Shoot there. Double 
Let's move you up a little. Let's start moving the cannon up. No, 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 you need to keep on firing. Come on, fire at the battery garrison. Beautiful. Go for the charge. Can I order you a melee with the battery garrison? Let's move up further. Okay, let's have you move up here. Order all of them to fire at the Granada's outskirt third company. You're not running, okay. Beautiful, they're routing. Okay, excellent, go for the charge. Beautiful. We're bringing these cannons all the way, but we can't use them. Because we're moving too fast. Let's move you over here. Let's move you over here. Move you over here. Perfect. Come on, get these guys. Let's send these guys to the village to help out. Let's send you over here. Come on, get these guys. Perfect.
Get him, boys. Capture village. Excellent. Easy win. I've been promoted to captain with command of a brig in a sloop. I dream of staying on Richmond, but would have remained a lieutenant. Promotion is better, no? We are anchored in the mouth of the San Juan River and are waiting. We have had no news from home, no news from Jamaica, no news at all. There is a saying, during war, no news is good news. But we need to replenish the food and rum for the men. Rumors about half rations may become reality in a matter of weeks. Okay, so let's see, new technology. Uh, siege artillery operations, work in progress, but I was told to get these done ASAP, so I am going to. Um, let's see. That's the news, I've read that before, so I'm not going to bother. And there's one battle, dinner for Admiral. We're going to get that, get to that in the next episode. So, I do hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe and all of that, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!